I once knew a dear lady that had so much potential, it was incredible. And yet every project that she started, she would eventually quit. What was lacking? What was lacking is lacking in a lot of us. And that is a valuable asset of patience. We must be patient. We must be willing to keep on keeping on even when it seems like we're not making any progress at all. Sometimes our greatest progress comes when we're not aware of it. If we'll just keep on, keep on praying, keep on looking to God, then we'll have our greatest victories. We will get to the finish line that we want to get to. It is a valuable asset that we all want, the asset of patience. Patience enables us to complete the projects that we set out in the beginning on day one to do. Patience helps us keep our emotions on an even keel so that neither small annoyances or even large challenges will throw us off balance because we have the God-given gift of patience. When we remain patient, we feel composed, we feel um, a composed sense of self and a confident sense of self. And we're ready for whatever is before us. And we lovingly accept God's plan of good for us. If the problem persists, we do not become disheartened. We know full well that God is bringing our good to us in the right way and at the right time. Think back on your life on those times when you toyed with the idea of giving up, but you didn't. You kept going. You were patient. Even though you couldn't see it with your human eyes, you just knew with God that everything was going to work out good, and it did. Thank God for patience. We're grateful for patience, for through it, we acquire a positive attitude. And we also, through it, acquire our heart's desires.